What's going on guys, BSD Spear here with IDARB Esports, and today, this week on IDARB Esports, we're bringing you IDARB Bootcamp Lesson 1, featuring the LAC boys themselves, learn to play like the pros, so without further ado, let's get started with IDARB. Alright, so first up, we're going to teach you some basic shots and trick shots. First up, 5 or 10 point shot, right from the get-go. Grab the ball, drop down to the lower platform. Boom. Upper right, stand to the edge of the platform. Upper right, V, and right in the goal. If you can hit the corner, you get a 10 point shot. Next up, another 5 or 10 point shot. Toss the ball to that corner. You're going to want it right up against the wall, 45 degree up jump and shot at the same time right into the goal. Next up, another five point shot. This one's from downtown. Boom, beautiful. Line up in the underneath the middle of the purple platform, aim right in between the two white platforms for a beautiful shot. Next up, five or ten point shot depending on a bounce. Grab the ball, walk up to the wall, jump straight up, don't even aim. Just release before you hit the, your head on the ceiling. Easy five points. Next up, we have a 10 or 15 point shot from the get-go. Grab the ball, walk up to the wall, jump, and while you're moving, aim lower 45 degree, more to the right though. Aim for the edge of the purple platform to get a 10 or 15 bounce shot. This one's going to be a 15 point shot. Here we go. Grab the ball, and as you're walking over, once you hit the purple platform, 45 degrees up at the white platform, jump and shoot. Beautiful, easy 15 points. Next up, we have grab the ball, 9 or 12 point shot, jump to the upper white platform, and land right in the middle, aim down 45 degrees, and bounce. If you can hit the front lip, you can make it a 12 point shot as well. Next up, we have a 6 point shot to throw your enemies off going to jump straight above the white platform, hit your head on the ceiling, and lower 45 degree aim. Hit it right on the lip, you can make it an easy 6 points. Our next shot we have is going to be a 20 with a 25 point shot. This one's crucial. Alright, so take it to the top, lower 45 degrees. You want to bounce on the end of the white platform. Run along and keep kicking it. Alright, next up we have another 20 point shot. Take it to the top, jump, as you hit your head on the ceiling, upper 45 degree aim. If you're lucky, you can get it to bounce right in the middle of the white platform and on the lip, 20 points. All right, our next shot is gonna be five or 10 point shot. This one's a little easier, get right in the middle, right on the top lane, jump right when you hit your head on the ceiling, release and easy five, 10 points most of the time. You can get that 10 point. All right, here's gonna be a slight variation of that, same thing, five or 10 points, jump straight up through the middle. This one's gonna be on the upper left of the middle platform and you'll release the shot button right as soon as you jump at the same time. Again, no aiming and you can get the lucky bounce, 10 points. All right, one more variation of that, it's gonna be the drop shot five or ten points, go up, and jump, drop straight into the middle, and as you're parallel with the top, release, and easy five-pointer shot. Alright, now this one's a 15 to 30 point shot. This one's pretty tricky, I'm not going to lie. I still can't get this one. Okay, end of the left platform, upper right, you want to shoot it off the ceiling, bounce it, and keep running just like the 25, 20 point shot. Alright, now these are going to be power plays that you can do to set yourself up for shots. If you're underneath the opponent's goal, upper 45 degrees, toss it up to yourself, you can set yourself up in the middle. Now the way these work is you move faster without the ball than you do with the ball, and you'll notice that on all these power plays. Power play number two, you get caught underneath the lower 
white platform on the opponent's side. Again, 45 degrees up. Toss it up to the middle to yourself. Set yourself up for another easy 10 to 15 point shot. Power play number three. You are caught behind the enemy goal. Jump up as right before you land. Lower 45 degree. Bounce it off of the goal. And you can get it to roll straight into the middle without getting caught on the upper lip. And again, you set yourself up. That's why it's called the power play, baby. All right, let's talk some defense. Defensive play number one, how to block that five point shot everyone seems to hit. Stand on that platform and move with the ball. Don't try to block it dropping down. Just move to the right and spam the trigger. Defensive play number two is if you're standing in this middle platform, you wanna jump up and anticipate the shot. Jump up, block it. Now, it'll have to change slightly depending on where you're at, depending on what shot they're going for, but that's why it's necessary to know the shots, so you know what shot to look for, and most of the time players will use the same shot. So defense is equally important. Alright, so next up, we're going to talk some maneuvering. Use the goal to your advantage, both offense and defense. As you can see, Mr. Hankey right now has the ball can maneuver quicker around the goal uh, than most of the time the defenders can. Now on defense, you can jump inside the goal and then out through the lip to get easy access to this top. Alright, how to counter a block. If they're blocking this five point shot, what you want to do, walk off the platform, almost underneath the other platform, and almost shoot straight up. And you can actually aim it around them standing on that platform. Now this one's going to be a little trickier. You're going to do the 10 or 15 shot, but you want to aim it right over their head, as close to the end of the platform as you can. That's two ways to counter someone trying to block your shot. Thanks for watching, guys. This is the BSD Spear, and I'm out. Tune in next time for Boot Camp Lesson 2 with the LAC Boys.